Hey you guys, it's me Sidra, and today I'm going to be showing you guys my foundation routine. Um, a lot of you guys were requesting it, so I just decided to do it today. Um, I know I haven't been making videos for a while, but that's because I was kind of sick, and if you guys can't hear me, I'm a little, like, congested. So, hopefully you guys will like this foundation routine and enjoy. So the first thing I really do is I use this Pond's Dry Skin Cream, and this is just, um, yeah, this is just a cream. And I usually just apply a little bit of it on my face where I'm usually dry. And here I'm just gonna show you guys lightly. Now I have medium and dry skin, so it depends on what I use. Um, sometimes I don't put this on when my skin's a little oily, but today it's actually kind of dry. And I'm just concentrating on the areas where I usually get like patches of dry skin, which is around here by my cheeks. And this is probably different for everyone else. Okay. Next what I do is I use my Maybelline Dry Liquid Mousse Foundation, and this is how it looks like. And I usually take a dime amount, like that much, and I take my stipple brush and I kind of just blow it around. Make sure it goes all over the brush, and I just kind of start on the from the bottom of my face, and then work up to the top, and I slowly go. Um, I go in circular motions just because I feel like more product comes on my face. I also like concentrate where there's more blemishes. Like here on the bottom, I have acne blemishes from when I used to have acne. So yeah. And then, I'm just going to put some on my nose. And now I'm going to concentrate on my forehead, and I'm just going to usually put a little bit of foundation on my forehead, because I usually don't have that many blemishes. Now since I have my foundation done, I'm going to set my face with a powder, and here I'm just going to use this MAC Skin Finish, and this is in medium dark. And here I'm just going to take my powder brush, and pat some, and I'm just going to go over um, my face like that lightly okay now what I'm going to do is I actually um, depotted both of my concealers and one's a liquid concealer and then one's um, a solid concealer and I depotted this because it was kind of running out and I just kind of wanted to save space so I put, in, I put it in this contact case now I'm going to take my brush my concealer brush and I'm just going to take some and I'm just going to kind of I use this as my highlighter and my concealer because I feel like it highlights and conceals at the same time and I actually put this on my upper lid when I put eyeshadow on but I'm not wearing eyeshadow today but I can just put it on my upper lid just, just for the fun of it I also use some of it to highlight my nose, and I just usually go, like, one down like that. Um, so yeah, that's my concealer. I'm just going to make sure it's all blended in. Don't want any streaks. And this actually just makes your eyes look more awake and open. Okay, so now what we're going to do next is I'm going to use another powder, and I'm actually just going to use the same powder brush, but this is my um, Mineral Wear Talc Free. Um, skin correcting powder and this is just in case some of my face like if it all just doesn't match up and it's just a really good setting powder so I'm just going to take some of this and it's really really chalky so I'm just going to kind of get some of that off and then I'm just going to kind of go around and put it on my face and this is actually a really good setting powder um, and this is like I usually use, use use this when I get a tan and um, my tan's not even, so this helps a lot. Now what I do is I curl my eyelashes, and before I do that, I just kind of make sure um, with an eyeshadow brush that um, this one's actually I never use. I actually use this for my eyelashes, but I kind of make sure that my eyelashes are straightened out because that annoys me. So I'm just going to kind of make sure this kind of combs my eyelashes out because I hate when my eyelashes clump. And are like all stuck together so I'm just going to kind of comb it out with this eyeshadow brush 
and that's what I kind of use this brush for. Yeah, I guess it's a... Okay. So now what I do is I take my curler and I curl my eyelashes. I count to like three. One, two, three. And then I curl. And then I use this. One, two, three. And then I curl. Now what I do is I use my Falsies Mascara. And that's it. And now what I'm going to do is I'm just going to put my mascara on. Okay, so now I use my blush brush and I take out my Coastal Suns blush palette and I usually use this Peachy King color for um, for school and I usually use this color if I'm going out, but right now I am going out, so I'm just going to use this color and I usually use um, bronzy colors if I'm going out and if I'm usually going to school, I stick with pink colors because it looks more natural. And then I'm just going to add some to my nose, make it look natural, and voila. Now the last part is I put on lip gloss in here. I'm going to be using this Cream Sheen Lip Gloss by MAC, and it's called Delight. So that was my makeup routine, and I hope you guys liked it. Thank you for watching.